Hello everyone, welcome back to more random games on the internet. I'm Yo's Cross Platinum and today we're returning to Alan Wake, but we need to find Alan Wake. So right now we're still on Saga. And we just freed my boy, my grandfather from the darkness. So this ought to be interesting, what he has to say now. That did it. Something is nagging at me. We, we need, need to, to look talk. at the case. <sighs> Damn right. Lots for me to explain. But not here. The night's got ears. We can have our talk in your head. You have a room there, right? How do you know about that? I'm your grandfather. <laughs> what don't I know? That man just said profile me. All right, let's gather up the clues what we got so far. Fact versus fiction. Yeah. I don't think we have anything else to go off of. Thanks, Saga. Why do they want to kill Wake? We have anything about the clicker? Who's involved? Yes. I just saw his name. <laughs> hmm. Now, where's the recruitment letter? Nah. Ah. There we go. I don't think I have anything else. Nope, the MMI note does not relate to them yet. Tor and Odin. They tried to recruit them. Not cult members. Good. Email proof of them trying to recruit them. There we go. Vladimir Bloom. Yes, we do have something about Vladimir Bloom. We're running low. There we go, dude. <clears throat> the 
Why do they want to kill the way? Keep trying. There we go, Thornton and Mulligan. There we go. Cultists of Bot no I don't I don't know. I'm trying to think of some other clues I can think of, but like I genuinely just do not know. All right, then. The previous murders have been closed. What about the story? Okay, okay. Overlaps require pieces of art to enter. Is that because of the dark places focus on art? All right, let's profile him. We got our information. You know about my mind place? How is that possible? We all have the power. Find the truth. Damn right I do. Odin already told you you're a seer. You can gaze into their heads, see the truth. See past the lies, past this bullshit horror story. Us Andersons are bound by it. You can fight it. Don't be the story. Make the story. It's true. I am a seer. I have a power. My mind place is more than I thought it was. This isn't my intuition. I'm seeing their thoughts. Is this why I know the truth about Logan? While well, everyone else forgot? Hold on. This is something wrong with my game, man. Yeah, 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 whatever. Back to the game. You said you were my grandfather. If that's true. Why wasn't I told about you? You were part of our fucked up family. Way before this horror story. I was a shitty fucking dad to Freya. Your mom didn't deserve that. Not one bit. Things were said and done. Not a day goes by I haven't regretted it. But that fucking father of yours didn't make things any easier. I know Freya is gone. So I need to apologize to you. I am sorry, Saga. I can see he's sorry. Mom said she didn't want anything to do with my grandfather. And that my father died before I could remember. It all matches. Tor and Odin are part of my family. You said you were a shitty father to my mom. Is that why she left? Freya never looked back. My girl was strong. Freya always thought our powers had a dangerous side. Odin and me did fuck with things that should not have been fucked with. Your mom had common sense. She raised you right. Kept you safe. I'm not surprised she didn't tell you about the Anderson power. She was always protecting me. Whenever I told my mom about my mind place, she called it make-believe. I wish she'd been more honest with me. At least towards the end. Maybe she just wanted you to live a quiet mom life. I wouldn't talk about my father. You knew him? Some doors are better left closed. Your dad was a c 
complicated bastard. Always thinking too many steps ahead. That's not how we work. There was trouble, and then he was gone. I didn't handle it well. Freya didn't want anything to do with me after that. I can't blame her. I never knew my dad or my mom's family. So many broken relationships in my past. I won't Damn. lose mine. With Logan. With David. I won't stop until they're safe. I have the clicker. Can I use it to save my daughter? I am. Get your guitar roaring and your drums crashing. Blow reality's eardrums. Just the light switch isn't enough. It's Tom's story we're dealing with, so he's got to be the one to rewrite it. After that's done, he can flick that switch to bring the whole thing home, baby. I can't use the clicker without Wake. Tom. Meaning Wake. He needs to rewrite the story first. I can't stop the horror story without him. The way Tor behaved? I'm surprised my mom hung around for as long as she did. But he is genuinely sorry. Hmm. Tor and Odin can actually speak with me in my mind place. Thanks to their own powers. Tor and Odin are my relatives. The Thank evidence you, fits with what I know is true. It's a lot to process. I'm trying to think. Oh. I just closed another case, but I gotta remember which case it was. Doesn't make sense. The story doesn't affect me like it does other people. Because of who I am. Because of my family. Wake needs to be the one to rewrite the ending. And I'll need to keep an eye on him. Hold on, we're still going. Definitely did say case solved, so Yep. There we I go. got the answers to these. Tor is here in the overlap. Gotta find him and get the fuck out. And we did it. Wake wrote Logan into the story. He had no right to use her like this. There is still time to make him fix it. I won't give him a choice. All right. Thanks for telling me this, Tor. 
I need to go find Wake to stop this. The old gods of Asgard will be ready to help. Me and my bro will bring the rock when you need it. Remember, your daughter is alive. Just kept from you by this bullshit horror story. I needed to hear that. Thanks, Grandpa. All right, let's go. We got to find the bucket. Is there any other bucket nearby? Like any other? Well, if we cut through the manor, the manna. That should help. But I don't think we have to do that anymore. All right, we've uh, we've had a lot of good runs with Saga, so um, let's go check on Mr. Wake. Our the FBC boy. is holding Wake at the sheriff's station. I need to make Agent Estevez understand. They have Wake, and I have the clicker. We have to work together to stop this. Casey, do you read me, Casey? Where are you, Casey? He better be okay. Focus, Saga. Get to the station to wake. And while she's about to prep to head to the station, and, you know, solve this whole case down pack, we're not doing that. We need to finally see Alice again. We're going to a different reality. Back, baby. This time we got ammo. Let's head. Let's head to the tower now. Ah, it's good to be back, Alan. I haven't seen you in a minute. Now let's go back to the tower. Let's go see what this whole big bus was about. I know we left on a big cliffhanger with Alan's story, but. Let's do it. Let's go home. Guess for me, huh? This is like that meanwhile shit right there. That's a little elevator music. Alice had turned the bathroom into a dark room. I needed to get inside the manuscript.
Hey, how's everything good? Just checking up on you. Oh, is that Barry? Aw, oh, poor Alice. Poor Barry, too, you know. I miss Barry. That was my dog. For months, after Alan died, I didn't leave the apartment. I was flattened. By the confusion. The shock. The, the guilt. Fear. Out of bed. Barry Wheeler started visiting. He even cooked me meals. I couldn't stand the guy when I first met him, but he's a better friend than I gave him credit for. Oh. He That's... still checks in. Even after he moved out west. Oh, Barry. Alice's work had consumed the apartment. Her whole life. There's another TV staticking in here. One morning, I saw a deer soar past my bedroom window. It was a, a balloon of some cartoon animal. And I looked out at the street below, and I saw a little girl crying. Like losing that balloon had just ended her whole world. It was the perfect image of the horror of caring. And that's when I got myself out of bed. And I picked up my camera. The third part. There was something in the dark. Something I needed to see, to show. The more shadows I photographed and filmed, the more I felt like I was on the verge of a breakthrough. I submerged myself in it. I only went out at night. My search became obsessive, but I still had no idea what I was looking for. Oh. Shit. There's a world hidden behind ours. A dark tide ebbing and flowing against reality. Faces in the shadows. Fear of the dark is really just fear of what could be that that vast paralyzing ocean. But photography can freeze reality in a snapshot, and put a cage around the infinite and capture it. I need to prove those faces are really there. Well, it's kind of come into reality. Look at that. The dark place. Do I move? Like, I was say, like, 
They've been panning over here for a minute. The full manuscript of a novel. Return. A horror story about the dark presence escaping from the dark place, taking over Bright Falls. I couldn't remember writing it. I had not written it. I would never write this. I knew who had. Scratch. A monster with my face. If this story came true, Scratch would get out, people would die. Destroying the manuscript, it wouldn't stop it from happening. I would have to fix it, edit it. I could not change the genre of the story. I'd have to work within the constraints set by Scratch. I needed someone in the story to fight the darkness. Saga Anderson. I kept seeing her in my visions. She was already in Bright Falls, already involved, but she was not in return. Not yet. I'd write her in, try to stop Scratch within the limits of the horror story. It was almost impossible. It was taking too long. I had not reached the end. Oh my god. Oh my god. Right when I was about to reach the end of the part. That's crazy. Man, he just popped off. Scratch stopped me before I could finish my edits to the manuscript. The memory of my edits was already fading. Terrible things would happen if the manuscript came true. Scratch was there, at Parliament Tower, undoing my work. He could use the story to escape. He could go after Alice. I needed a new draft of the story. One that would get me ahead of Scratch. I couldn't add a new element from here. I'd have to go to the scene. Let's type away then. Zane had said we worked on Return together. That was a lie. Scratch wrote Return. I would pay Zane another visit. He had guided me to two murder sites. I needed a new one to get back to Parliament Tower. A new draft of initiation. I type, I write, I show, I glow. My mind is just an enigma. Oh God, we're back. We're not switching reality, we just got here. Let's go to the show. I don't have time for this, so let's get it over with. Tell me, was this all fake? A show? No one said otherwise, Mr. Wake. It was to indulge you, but we can stop pretending now. Uh, masks come off. Oh, I wouldn't go that far. I don't even think you know who's under your mask, but you know how to make things difficult for yourself. All these rules, endless, convoluted loops you insist on going through. 
You are so lucky. You know? There are so many people helping you. Armies of people. Myself. Your wife. Alice. I need to get to her. She's in danger. She is. Because of you. And so is someone important to me, someone you pulled into this. You keep opening doors, peeking in, reaching through to get what you want, and that puts you in my path. I don't know what you're talking about. I have to go now. Maybe you will make it through this time. This has gone on long enough. This and our night springs, it was a nice distraction. It's time someone gave me a straight answer here. The next time we meet, the circumstances will be very different. And you would do well to return the favor by playing your part. Or stay out of my way, Mr. Wig. Whatever you say. That's crazy. Door, Zane, the masks were finally coming off. Was it a sign I was closer to escaping? I had no time to waste. Very careful, very careful. I couldn't get in. I was missing something. Not weak. You scared the shit out of me, dog. I ain't even gonna lie. You like that clean getaway? Just keep the flashlight off and keep moving slowly. That guy looks like he's about to fight me. And he's gone. We have to tread fucking carefully, y'all. The dark place is not a place you want to be in. And plus, I need to figure out what chapter I am with Saga. Wake! Not wake. This is wake. Jake. Hurry, Tom. Here is the light at the end of the tunnel. If you come in last, you won't be happy. Huma, wow, that held you close, Tom. Ei muuta kuin on vaan set the cranny in the snow. When the panic is biggest, the help is also near. Door didn't seem happy to see me this time. Hearing the master is the root of wisdom. But don't let the game get you down. He's playing his role. Maybe put him in your films, Tom. Like you have put me. <laughs> what films? <laughs> I'm a fan of your masterworks. Uh, there is Tom the Poet, my favorite. And Uerden Uer is the most famous one, of course. And... Is it true what I hear? That it's coming back to cinema soon? Is there a bottom to this rumor? I need to get back to my apartment. Can you help me? Well, plan is half done. You asked me to make sure you won't forget the... the... What was the photograph? The light pictures. The photos your artist wife took. 
They are waiting in the shoebox in the basement. What you leave behind, you find in front of you. Okay. Thanks, Adi. Find a shoebox in the basement. Please tell me there's the way downstairs. All right, cool. Let's not run. You already know we're going to a basement. That's the last place people want to be in the first place. find Alice's photos in a shoebox. Uh-oh, TV. Must be important. Oh, God. Good evening. A writer trapped in a dream world attempts to write a story to shape reality around him and escape. He is beset by visions leaking in from realities beyond his own. He uses those visions as inspiration for his stories in hopes of giving them power to make them come true. Us, hidden few, know that ultimately he will succeed. But before that, many of his stories collapse back into the stuff that dreams are made of to remain as they began, works of fiction. And yet, maybe there is a gleam of truth to be unearthed from these tales. Rare glimpse into the unseen realities beyond our own, offering us intriguing avenues of contemplation as they transpire in the Night Springs. Ooh. Night Springs. I do need to play the DLC soon. But I ain't got no money. It's getting a little red. Well, it looks like nothing's important on this table. And now I am on the table. Okay. Now I am the table. Alright. Excuse me. Shimmling my way downstairs. Give my light back. Oh, never mind. You can have it. Alan Wake. No, Alan. There's no Alan out here, just just Jake. Jake Park. Alan Wake. Wake. No wake. Just Jake. Wake. Later, bro. Get it. There's gotta be something down here, right? Hmm. 
about to spawn it. There we go. These were Alice's photos. I recognize the style. One showed the clicker sinking into darkness. The other showed a light in the shape of a bullet. They were important, even if I didn't know what to do with them yet. That guy did not see me. That guy dumb as hell. Just gonna slowly mind my business. Ha <laughs> I'm behind a safe wall. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Weak. Nothing. Ha <laughs> ha, loser. I'm out. Later. For war to sing Utenue in the cinema. But first, I work. And the work won't end even when you do it, Perkel. Oh, I seen. One potato at a time. Just remember, Tom. The brave will eat the pea soup. Interesting. I'm sorry. Get me out of here. We gotta walk though. We gotta be careful. Can't trust these things, you know? Swap back to reality. The dark drowning. I'm drowning. I'm drowning. No way out. There's no way out. It's deeper, deeper, deeper. This is hell. I'm in hell. I died. Oh, so we can't let me die. I just want to sleep. Please. Let me sleep. I'm so tired. I just want to go home. I've written so much. I write. I write. There's nothing left. Oh God, I don't know how to write. All the words are gone. There's no more words. Where they go? Can I eat the words? I recognize these words. Who are the words moving? This is familiar. Oh, this is familiar. I, I've been here before. Have I said this before? I've read this somewhere. Where am I? Who am I? I'll wake. I'll wake. That's a strange name. Hey, wait. That sounds like a character name. I, I, I write that name up. I make that one name up. I, I don't want to be a character. I, I don't want to be the story. Just. Oh, Jesus I, Christ, I dude. Okay, let's see what chapter we're at with Sokka. Because, Jesus Christ. You know, Alan's having a good time, so let's get back into the car. 
Where did I park? I don't think I parked my car here. Go to the sheriff's station. Oh, we are on the main road back to the sheriff's station. But there is an optional path down here we can take. Like, does that whole path cut off? Um, we can explore for a bit. Why not? Are we going back the right way? Yep, we're going back the right path. Let's check that other path. Before we even think about heading to the remote station. One of these bad boys cars I can borrow. No. That's alright. I parked my car all the way back in fucking Bright Falls. You already know. We'll have to cut to the house and go to the backyard. It's always frame rate, frame ready in the goddamn woods. We play Saga Story, I swear. Yeah, I'll see you soon. Alright, so we gotta cross the bridge then. And see if we can go down this path. But I'm just bolt cutting all the doors because that shit pissed me off that all these were locked. A manuscript. When Cynthia Weaver was downstairs at breakfast, Rose snuck into her room. With all the lamps in the room, it took her a while to find the one with an angel. Luckily, the dream Alan had sent her had been very clear. Rose was certain that Cynthia would not miss one lamp. She had so many. Tonight, Rose would put the lamp in a shoebox and let it sink into the garden pond. That's what Alan wanted. That's how she could help him. The thought made her whole body buzz with joy. Cynthia knew the lamp was missing the very moment she came back to her room. She was overcome by grief. It had been Tom's lamp, one of the few things that reminded her of him. It had not worked in a long time with the cord severed and the light switch gone. But there are other kinds of lights than the ones we can see. The invisible light of the angel lamp had held Cynthia together all these years. With tears welling in her eyes, she didn't see the shadows shifting in the corners of her room. Okay. Is that the gate right there? That looks like it. Oh, 
I don't have a lot of I don't have a lot of bullets, so you know this is a great time to scavenge it up. Whoa. <laughs> hey bitch, get the fuck away from me. Come on, I'd be crazy like that. Learn your place trash. Damn, that motherfucker went for fury swipes. What a bitch. Another one of those cult boxes. Well, taking Wolf is kind of crazy if you really think about it. Oh no, that, that felt like a Dead by Daylight hitbox drag right there. That's some bullshit, and you know it, game. How did he survive that head on? Now, you know what? Bitch. I got one bullet left. Let me reload the crossbow just in case. So I ain't got no ammo. I got no fucking ammo. Okay, so this says go this way. I don't see the next sign. There we go. Hopefully it's some pistol ammo or shotgun ammo, cause Jesus Christ. I like just pump mad iron into that motherfucker, you know? Oh, shotgun ammo. Oh, not bad. All right, back on the main road we go, and then we keep going down. What's over here? Up next, we had um, we had a guest lined up. I have it written down here somewhere. What's this say? Jim Figamore. 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 I know that name from somewhere. Somebody's yeah, 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 yeah. We we already dealt with that. Trust me, man. You're a little behind on the show. Catch up with the lore, man. Read the book. Did you not read Return? pretty cool I definitely want to try to take some photos after I beat the game so uh be ready for some Alan Wake photography I'll definitely replay the game and try some photos
It looks fun. I like photos. I need to unlock his classic outfit when you beat the game. We're approaching a house. See what's up here. Maybe more ammo, because we need to scavenge what we can. Ah, tea in the cannabis, huh? Jesus Christ, he had his own band. That stash at straight down the path. I hate being in the woods. Two frame ready. Another cult stash. Another cult box. Oh, fuck. I was not expecting that much bullshit. <laughs> I did not expect three enemies back to back right there. Psalm's in. I did not expect three enemies. Damn, three? Where's the respawn? Real fast. Man. Damn. You guys smacked me all the way back here. I don't even know where I'm at anymore. I had some decent ammo down there, you bastards. Alright, fine. I don't feel like going all the way back down there. Let's go check on the sheriff station and see the plot driven. Because again, I still need to know what chapter we are. But that sucks. Maybe I can unlock infinite ammo. Is infinite ammo a thing? The world may never know. But all I know is, getting out of the woods. Damn, Alan took all that goddamn ammo. I should know. Shame on me for stealing all that shit. I thought I was going to play as him a little longer. I should have realized I was in Saga Store. I shouldn't have looted. Like a little loot goblin. Oh, yeah, no, since we're already over here. Load my gun up. We're here. Sheriff Station's down the block. Hello, hello. Dude, the frame rates are just destroying themselves. Let's see what chapter we're on. Those people just burst in here and expect others to clean up after them. Sheriff Station should be this building. Oh, this building at the end of the block. Oh, he does. I don't like the sounds coming from the station. Uh oh. Sounds like taken. My health is good. Let me get the shotgun ready. The 
Turn six. Scrap. Power's out. Always a good sign. There's taken inside. All right, hold on. Holding cells. Is that where they're keeping Wake? We got a door is locked, though. You, Red, Logan, Brown. The trap. Yeah, you're a little too strong for my appetite. All right, the FBI agents are dying left and right. They're all becoming taken. Anyone here? I'm here. I don't have a key to your joint. I don't have the key. She said I'm here in the closet. Well, looks like it's my lucky day, y'all. We still got bullets. That shit crazy, dog. Need to find the key. Agent Estevez? Is that you? That leg doesn't look good. <sighs> it feels even worse. But thanks for saving the rest of me. We should talk. What happened here? <laughs> Where to fucking start? We came to check out a system alert at Cauldron Lake, but it's worse than we could handle. Real boondoggle. The police, my own agents, most were invaded before we could even react. Have you found my partner, Agent Casey? Yeah, we found him. Out in the woods. He had a close encounter with the Shadow, and it did something to him. Is he okay? He's alive. We took him down to the morgue for an examination. Haven't heard anything since the attack. What did the FBC come here to do? Bright Falls is the site of a recurring altered world event. The shadow is stronger than we expected. We're low on resources. Problems at HQ. But we do have equipment for dealing with the shaded threat. We were just caught off guard before we could set it up. Where is Wake? I know what's going on here. Wake can fix this. Alan Wake is a para-utilitarian. The word's a mouthful, so you know it's serious. We have him locked up in the holding cells per protocol. He's connected to the Shadow in some way. Estevez, I need to see Wake. How do I get into the cell block? Okay. <laughs> Protocols don't mean that much at this point anyway. Don't make me regret this, Anderson. Until the power's back on, the door to the holding cells won't open. There's a fuse box downstairs in the basement. Here. I'll need these keys. Thanks. We're gonna investigate a little bit. Back into the morgue, huh? Fantastic. loot up don't forget ABC okay this will prove useful eventually we gotta get ourselves back into the morgue like last time They say Casey's downstairs. Do you read me, Anderson? I read you. Have you had our frequency this entire time? Eavesdropping is a big part of the job. But no, I got it from your partner. 
Anderson, look for a fuse to replace the blown out one in the fuse box. That should get the power going again. Yeah. On it. Another one of those cult boxes. Okay. These cult boxes are pissing me off. Got some bullets now. Stay the fuck down! Casey! Is that you? Anderson? Aw, oh, Casey, you're alive. For now. Hey, Anderson. Like what I've done with the place? Hmm. Could use a bit more light. <sighs> Funny. How are you holding up? Ah, don't give me that worried look, Anderson. It's just a, it's a flesh wound. <laughs> Gave me a chance to have a, a nice chat about ex-wives with uh, Kieran. Uh, Agent Estevez, I mean. Making new friends, uh, huh? I'm jealous. Are you sure you're okay? Yeah, I'm fine. What's the situation on your end? What happened at the hotel? Wake was telling the truth about the cult being after him. The thing, the dark presence, it's real too. I saw it, a fucked up monster cloud. Wake tried to warn me. It knocked me out. FBC found me in the woods later. Watery turned out to be a good lead. Found the clicker and the cult. But the horror story is changing reality. Like Wake said it would. Logan, she's, uh... The story claims she died here. But we can stop it. Wait, Saga. What do you, um... Logan is gone. What? She has been. For a long time. What? Casey's affected by the horror story, too. I'm fighting for them all now. I'm gonna fix this, Casey. You, Logan, all of it. I just need to get the power back on first. Yeah, give him hell, Anderson. Just remember, some things in life can't be fixed with a light switch. As for the power problem, here. I found a fuse on those poor bastards there. I'll take care of it. Stay put, Casey. I'll let you know when it's safe. I'm not going anywhere. <clears throat> Anderson, good news, quick. bad news. You can get to the cell block now, but the shaded hostels that were in there are on the loose. Thanks for the heads up. <laughs> Come on. Who's down. next? I wonder if Alex will help me. Please be evolved to whatever the fuck this monstrosity is. Situation is under control, Estevez. Coming Damn, back. Casey, you could have dropped me some banjo. Here. Yo, wait here. Of course you will, motherfucker. You could have just pulled the trigger a little. I know you got some bullets left, motherfucker. God damn it. 
Right when I needed you. Alright, let's go check on Wade. Anderson, over here. Behind the counter. Got a little cramped in that closet. What's going on? We had a hell of a time avoiding those taken. Ended up back here. <sighs> anyway, I wanted to warn you that we have the Coscula brothers in the cells as well. They're the ringleaders of the cult of the tree. Don't let your guard down. Is the FBC sending any help? <sighs> we were the help. Well, us in the lake house. But we still have bureau gear specifically engineered to fight this threat. It's stored in the back lot. We were setting it up when the Taken interrupted us. We have light arrays, a containment cell, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. We are not out of this fight yet. All right. Wish me luck. According to the Luck and Probability Department, it's statistically bad luck to wish people good luck during a crisis. Thanks. <laughs> Saga. Fucking FBI, FBC, you government fucks all fucking this up for us. Let us the fuck out! You're the leaders of the cult. You're not going anywhere. Wake will ruin everything. Get rid of him, Saga. You fucking shot me. Typical government stooge. Let me out so I can kill him. That fucker! You come to our town and act like you know what you're dealing with, but you have no fucking idea. Let us out. You can't stop it. None of you can. We can take care of this. We've been preparing for this. Saga, do you have it? You wrote Logan into the story. You told me yourself from the dark place. Listen, Scratch is coming. He's, he's close. He's almost here. He's... My daughter is dead because of you. She's a child. What the fuck is wrong with you? I'm trying to fix this. I will fix this. I'll save everyone, but we're running out of time. I need the clicker. I have the clicker. You will fix this. You will save my daughter. Promise me. Yes, I promise. But we're out of time. Hurry! Don't fucking give it to him! He's a fucking monster, Saga! There it is. We've been waiting for you, motherfucker. I'm gonna fucking destroy you! Oh god, it's Scratch. That's where he got the jacket from. Shit, 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 shit. It's Scratch. He was pretending to be Wake. The plan is fucked. Estevez, come in. Scratch is here. How do I stop him? Bad news. The containment unit isn't trapped, but the light array should affect him. How do I activate the lights? He never found out. New idea. Yo, this man don't give a fuck about no flames. He's too fast. Ah! I need more time. I can't believe they, they actually had Mr. Scratch as the battle pass skin for the thing. That's super cool. 
I was wondering where that outfit got came from. I didn't know you killed him. This man has so much shit going on on him, I can't even. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. You motherfucker! He's too fast. Alright, time to run. Damn it! I need more time. God damn, bro. There must be a way to slow him down. I'm Man, fucking hurts. What about these? He's too fast. <laughs> gotta think, gotta think, gotta think, gotta think, gotta think, gotta think. Gotta think. I think, 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 I think. What can I do to distract him? You know, I thought the flare was gonna work. Oh fuck, he knows. Ah, Alan. Fuck. Need to activate those cubes. I'm trying, motherfucker. And we're out of mess. But not out of trauma packs. Come on, turn around and look this way. Another core activated. Only one left. Doing great. Come on.
Come on, 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 That's crazy. Scratches wakes double. He tricked us. He almost got the clicker from me. The whole plan has gone out the window. How could we get this so wrong? Textbook boondoggle. You said it, Anderson. It's a shit show. So what's the plan? We need to figure out a plan to do. That's actually a way better shotgun than what I got. All right, gang, we're going to take a break from here. Manually save. We're going to keep doing a little bit more saga until we're caught up. And then we gotta do we gotta finish this we're almost to the end y'all thank y'all for watching tune in next time for more random games on the internet i'm your host cross and i'll see you guys next time later